I go anywhere, anywhere with you, cause you feel my mind, or you feel my mind. We could build a dream, start up something new, let the old be dead, let the shadows leave my head. When the world is on your shoulders and you feel like falling over, just come a little closer. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I am so happy to have you here and I hope you're all doing amazing. So today's video is going to be an organizational video. I am going to be organizing underneath my sink and I wanted to share with you guys some of my before and what process I, cr I did to organize underneath my sink. So for the most part, everything that I have with the exception of the drawers are all things I've already had from before and I'm just going to be using what I have and I wanted to share with you guys a process to give you some motivation to get started with your organizational project so the first thing I did was give my cabinet a good wipe down and clean up and make sure to check my pipes to to just overlook and make sure that there's no leaks or holes or tears and patch anything up that needed to be patched to be honest full disclosure we recently uh, renovated our kitchen so I wasn't too worried about the pipes because my father-in-law is a really really good general contractor and he's the one that helped us with our piping and I am 100% confident but if your kitchen is a little older definitely make sure to check underneath the sink even if you're not organizing it make sure to look for any leaks or anything that may do some damage to your cabinets so here I'm going to be using this marble shelf liner that I got from Walmart if I can find the link I'll definitely post it on the description box below now here I'm just trying to figure out how I want to place this shelf that I got from Amazon. Again, I will post the link in the description box below if you're interested in purchasing one for yourself. I had bought these shelf liners. It's a two-tier shelf hanger that you put on your doorway. I was trying to measure out to see if they fit and unfortunately they don't so I had to return them but I got them from Amazon. I will also post these in the link description below so that if you're in search of one and you need this you can definitely get it. It's two for I believe it was $24 and unfortunately I wasn't able to use it because my sink is too low and the top shelf was rubbing up against the sink. So working with what I already had from before, I decided to kind of rearrange everything underneath my sink and use these dish baskets. Now the small one in the center I got from Dollar Tree and the larger one to my left I actually purchased from Walmart a few years ago and I've used them for many things throughout the years and this time around I'm going to be using it to house my lids for my pots and pans and my pots and pans are actually next to my under, under the sink uh, in my Lazy Susan. That's where I house everything. So pretty much at this point, I'm just trying to arrange all of my sponges and my cleaning supplies. Now to be honest, I don't keep all of my cleaning supplies underneath the sink. I only keep what I use for my living room and kitchen underneath the sink. And then all the other cleaning supplies that I do have, I have those downstairs in my laundry room. And any overflow is in my second pantry that I have downstairs. You cry yourself to sleep. Now this little hanging shelf that I have on this door here is actually from Ross. I bought this many, many years ago and I honestly forgot that I had it until I was looking through my supplies, realized that I had it, it was still in its box and decided to use it and it worked perfectly because I was able to use some 3M tape and hang it on the wall. It's just gonna house my sponges and my sink stopper. So just rearranging a couple of things here just to make sure everything fits properly and that's it. So I really enjoy this system. It is so much easier to grab my cleaning supplies. I don't have to keep looking for them and searching for them. And underneath the sink, I am confident that if anyone needed to go in there, a friend or family can go underneath my sink with confidence and I won't be embarrassed with the mess that it was before. So that's everything for this video guys i hope you liked it if you did please make sure to leave me a thumbs up and if you have not subscribed yet 
make sure to hit that subscribe button and also click on that notification bell so you'll be notified of future videos I post. I hope you all have a great day and I cannot wait to see you on the next video. Until then guys, have a great one. Bye.